Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. As you can see, I'm in my studio again. It's been a couple of months, but I'm here, I'm filming. I do plan to make some changes to make this a little more cozy, a little less like formal looking, I guess. But I wanted to just go ahead and jump right into a very fun video. I'm gonna be showing you how I use the Palm Springs MM backpack as a diaper bag. So typically we use this as our diaper bag. I think it's just from Target. We had it on our registry. It's apparently Eddie Bauer. Couldn't have even told you that. But yeah, it's a great bag. It's obviously unisex, so that's awesome. But sometimes we want to be a little bougie. And so I thought it'd be fun to show you how I could pack this as my son's diaper bag. So one thing to keep in mind when you're using something like this as a diaper bag, or really any bag as a diaper bag, specifically bag Backpacks, making sure that the items you're using the most or reaching for most often are going to be on the top of the bag. So I'm going to start with the things that I take with me but probably won't be reaching for and work my way up to the most used like diapers and wipes. So starting off, I want to talk to you about this device. This is called the Life Vac. Uh, and it's an anti-choking device. So basically, you put this on the edge of their mouth and you can essentially suction out whatever food they're choking on. It's something that hopefully we would never have to use, but what's great about it is it's good for adults and for children. By the way, this sounds like an ad. It totally is not. I bought this with my own money. And uh, we have one in our house at all times. This is their to-go pack and we just keep it with us, honestly, for peace of mind. It's something that hopefully we will never ever have to use, but I do believe on the website, if you order directly through them, if you are to ever have to use this, they will replace it for free, which is great because obviously no one ever wants to have to. But again, peace of mind, it works for adults. Even if somebody was in a restaurant and they were choking, we could easily pull this out and try to help them. So anyway, that's always at the very bottom of the diaper bag and I feel more comfortable having it in there. The next thing I'm not going to pull out because it's so annoying to get out of this little bag, but it's called the Busy Baby. I got it on Amazon. Essentially, it's a silicone mat that suction cups to restaurant tables and then you can put food on there and then it has has like all these random little things for the kids to play with, kind of just keep them distracted, keep their hands moving, make them content when sitting at a restaurant. It's honestly changed our lives when going to restaurants because it's just so easy. It keeps my son content. And yeah, we can put his food like directly on it, just as it's showing here, the little baby on the front. And then we don't have to worry about him eating like directly off the table or anything. So these are just two like extra essentials. Uh, usually we always have an extra outfit with us. Right now, Jammy are just the easiest to carry with because hopefully we don't have to put him in the extra outfit but it takes up the least amount of room it's only a one piece you don't have to worry about like a shirt and pants or a onesie and a sweatshirt and etc etc uh, but I also do keep an extra pair of socks especially now that my son is walking I just I feel like you know it doesn't take up a lot of room and you can never be too prepared I'm gonna be honest I watched a video it might have even been a mom packing this as a diaper bag I think it was from maybe three or four years ago. I do not remember who it was. I watched like a ton of these videos back to back like a year ago. And yeah, so if anybody knows who this was, please link their channel down below. But she recommended these little bags. It actually comes in a three pack, but I'm currently only using two. There's one that's a little bit smaller than this one and I just don't find that I need it for anything. Uh, these are great. It keeps everything so organized and easy. So we'll start off with this one. This is like the medicine or essentials. So usually I'd have an extra pacifier in here, but I don't at the moment. So I just have Motrin, the little Motrin uh, medicine, you know, how you give it to him. I have my son's inhaler and the inhaler mask that you have to use and a snot sucker. So that's currently in here. These are things that we do use quite often. And then I have this larger one. So this has about six diapers in it, some boogie wipes, and then some desitin. And then lastly, what I would put in here is wipes. Obviously, that's gonna be what I use the most. And that fills this to the top. Now there is a pocket in the back here that I didn't put anything in. So I would typically put my wallet, my keys, and my phone in there. That way I can access them easily. There's also this front pocket here that can be utilized. But honestly, once this is pretty full, it's a little bit annoying to get in here. I could easily fit my phone, wallet, and keys just in that pocket if I really wanted to. But yeah, I just like putting it in that pocket that's like in the back of here. So yeah, I love these straps on this bag. It's super comfortable, especially with all your baby 
essentials in here. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe so you don't miss out on the next one, and until next time, bye.